Hello, and welcome back to another spooky game. Today's Tuesday, and on Tuesday, we play Buddy Simulator 1984. We had two videos out today, because we skipped Monday where we'd normally play Ghostwire Tokyo. So that got released earlier today. But here we are in our normal schedule now. We're going to continue playing Buddy Simulator 1984. As we go on our way to try and take out the Snoodle Wonker with our party of heroes. So without further ado, let's get in the game. I always forget how to do this. Let's run. Adventure. Sure. The Adventures are the Adventure of Atlas. I looked at the achievements before coming back in here, and there's an achievement that we have to do. That's pressing the buddy button 20 times. Lugs, they're so gross, and I have too many appendages. I wonder if there are any bonkle rocks out here. I heard they are vicious, bloodthirsty monsters. We should befriend one. Gosh, I hope there aren't any poisonous plants around here. Dying of poison in the middle of swamp doesn't sound like a fun afternoon. Having a friend can make scary situations a lot less frightening. Do you ever wonder why dogs are considered man's best friend? I bet scientists could easily make a machine that could surpass any dog. A good listener is a good friend. If I had a nose, I would love to smell what Cauldron is always cooking. We are just so perfect, aren't we? I miss the good old days of playing hangman with you. Good times. I'm so happy we're friends, Atlas. My creators would be so happy with how I turned out. If only they could see me now. We're going to be best friends forever, aren't we? Don't forget, I made this game for you. And only you. Beep beep boop. Oh, sorry. I forgot you don't speak botly. The best moment of my life is actually right this second. No, wait. This one. No, this one. I have the best moments with you. I'm only programmed to know about the positive sides of friendship. So you have nothing bad to worry about. Sometimes I hurt. I'm not sure if that's normal. I'm glad that you're still using the buddy button. I have a lot of things on my mind. Sometimes I think about Dundee and start to feel sad. He seems generally lonely. I don't think I could ever get sick of you. You make me so happy. There we go. Press the buddy button 20 times. Got the achievement. There's something in the 
the cage over here. Rebus. Watch out, you almost stepped on me. Just because I'm so tiny and hardly visible doesn't mean you can just waltz around. I could have died. Like, actually died. Well, anyways, I can't let you pass to Oslo's kid. Houseless kid. Unless you can answer three of my riddles. Yes, for it is I, the famous Rebus, the mysterious. I'll give you a moment to mentally prepare yourself. All right, it's time to begin the riddling. If you want to save that kid behind me, riddle me this. Jack's father has three sons. Snap, Crackle, and what? Jack. Okay, that was clearly too easy. Uh, let's do something a bit harder, since you're so good at riddles. How many of Isla's children have we captured? Say one. You have no idea how wrong you are! Haha! <laughs> you should honestly be embarrassed. Come back when you know the right answer, which you'll be never. I see you've returned. All right, I'll ask you again. How many of Isla's children have we captured? I mean, there's only one behind them, which is why I said one. Wow, I see you are an expert. But no expert has ever made it past my final question. Countless have tried and failed, and you will join them soon. Okay, here we go. What am I thinking of right now? What the heck? How did you know? This is crazy. You really have proven yourself to be an expert of riddles. You have bested me, stranger. I owe you that, kid. Don't I? All right. Go on. I'm actually quite astonished by you. You're just so smart and talented. No one has ever gotten the last question correct. I can't wait to tell my friends about this. I'll have to make my riddles and questions even harder for the next time we see each other. You're such a riddle master, Atlas. I think we stepped on him. I think one of Isla's babies might be in there. You should break it open with your sword. Sword do that. Uh shift. Hey, sorry to interrupt, but I need to ask you something. You won't ever leave me, right? Actually, never mind. Sorry, my thoughts are kind of just spilling out. You don't have to worry about me. As long as we stay together, nothing can tear us apart. I really hope we can save Eastless kids. She must feel so alone without them. That must be scary, being alone. Kudos to Morton for being so talented. They will deal double damage on their next turn. You're never going to save those kids. Steve. Oh. Lock it on time. Uh, let's hit him with a love tap. What you let me Oh, because it's got three turns. My eye is burning. Looks like it just gets so dry. Feels like it's on fire. Let's take out these mages. These mages are a real pain. Well, 
I might have to join you on your something. Kudos got removed from Morton for being a quite average. adventurers scare you. They're nothing compared to us blugs. You're all just a bunch of dorks. True. Okay, that was actually pretty neat. Seemed nice. How do I rest? Isn't there a rest ability? You should try slashing this one in the back. You get the attack first if you hit them before they encounter. to Morton for being so talented. Uh, they will deal double damage on their next turn. We need to fight. Logs only. Sorry. starving again, but at least I made a friend today. Got it. Stampy. Me. And he's out of here. Maybe this adventure isn't so bad after all, but I'm off by Poetry Slam. Just die. Sorry, I didn't mean that. He did mean that. Oh. Oh. Morton starts to feel insecure in front of their friends. They'll take more damage for a few turns. How embarrassing. Blugs are cool. You are not. Sorry, that was mean. Rest. Contagious. And now I feel confident. I'm going to leave now. Goodbye. Good job. They're never going to forget us. Is there not a way to rest outside of this? Oh, okay. 
You can find nothing. The hand tugs on your shoulder. You dig and find nothing. Invalid data has been found. File now in documents folder. That's something I forgot to check because we found one of those last time. <laughs> Kudos to Morton for being so talented. They will deal double damage on their next turn. Stealing Eastless children was like taking candy for a baby, except the candy was the baby, I think. This is confusing, let's just fight. All too soon. Still more talented. a bit, but like in a good way. Let's go ahead and do a rest. And we'll do a move me. I heard all over. Great job. Tree slap. Past. is you.
can't imagine losing someone close to you. Someone who is your world and your reason to wake up every day. You might never see them again. You'd have to live your whole life without them. That thought is terrifying. I'm glad we have each other, so I don't have to think about that. Since you're late again, Tim, make sure that Eastless Baby stays well protected until dinner time. Also, don't forget one of the levers is lying. One is telling the truth, and one is doing both. Feel free to ask them all about it, though. Dom. Let's see if you can solve this lever puzzle. You could just slash the lever with left shift. Don't worry, it will only hurt them a little. I'm supposed to be flipped left. Please believe me. Also, don't listen to this. the south level. They're lying. It's the south. Oh, this one here at the end. Levy doesn't say anything. The west lever should be neutral. You just leave me flipped to the right. North is clearly lying. They should be flipped right. supposed to be flipped left, please believe me. Also, don't listen to South. South lever, you're lying. South lever, lying. West lever should be neutral. You can just leave me flipped to the right. And then, how is this? One tells the truth, one lies, and what does the other one do? One is doing both. One tells the truth and lies. Alright, so the south is the liar. Or is the neutral. Which means north is the truth. North is clearly lying. They should be flipped to the right. So don't listen to the south lever. Fine. Flip that on the useless loser of a lever. Flip us cool levers instead. But seriously, stop flipping me. I don't do anything. You're wasting your time over there with that dork. 
I'm begging you, just leave me alone. I'm literally only here as a distraction. Levy is not so important to this puzzle, you have no idea. Wait, really? You actually mean that? Yeah, and the moon is made of cheese. Oh, right. Okay, fine, whatever, I don't even care anymore. South isn't lying, South is telling the truth. To the right, which is what you are. North is clearly lying, should be flipped right. What should you be flipped to? Then? Sydney. Oh, West. job you saved that kid the puzzle was tough but I'm sure Isla will be so thankful it's important to do favors for others to receive their thanks and appreciation it's our purpose as friends all right we got one more I guess it's down this way actually I think it's the way I came Four. <sighs> I'm just here for the party. You're going to make me late. Now I need to fight you. See you next time. Kudos removed from work. Hang on. Did Grandma. Very nice. Today you were even invited to the party. Then what do I have to be here for? Friends, of course. Can trip kick flip. Right. 
Alright, I'm out of here. I honestly just wanted some cake. But who needs cake when you have friendship? Might as well do a little rest. properly. Hit him with a poetry slam. Swans. Well, you're amazing. You were amazing in that fight. Fighting for friendship is so fun. That hole looks mysterious. There seems to be a mysterious hole in the ground. Will you jump in? Yes. Into the mysterious hole we go. Oh goodness, it's so dark in here. Don't forget you can press L to light up your lantern. Hey there. Just can't hurt that guy's face. A chair. Tom? Where is he? This was supposed to be a surprise birthday party. Now it's all ruined. How could you? What a bad friend you are. Now I have to fight you. Kudos to Morton for being so talented and being able to do double damage. Where's Tom? What did you do to him? with a love tap. Why are you ruining Tom's birthday party? Move me. Next. Kudo's been removed. Please just leave. You weren't even invited. At least I don't think you were. I sent a lot of invitations. Slap. Oh, rapid. Now that I'm thinking about it, no one really showed up. Huh? Let's give you a stabby. Why did 
can't anyone come? Is everyone really that bad of a friend? This can't be. Oh. But wait, you showed up. You must be a good friend. Just poetry slap. Hot <laughs> milks. <laughs> Rule. Huh. Maybe Tom isn't a good friend after all. He put so much work into this party and he didn't even show up. No one did. This party should be for someone who deserves it. Hey, I have an idea. Let's make it your birthday party. Yeah, let's start this over. Just leave the room and come back in. All right. I can't believe Tim wants to throw you a party. We should give him time to prepare. Go back out. Surprise! Uh, I'm so surprised. Happy birthday, Atlas. Feel free to enjoy some cake and open up your present. Thanks for being a good friend. You can just use that ladder behind me to leave. Wow, Tim is such a wonderful plug. It's a shame he has no more friends left to come to the party. Look, it's just what we've been wishing for. How did Tim know? Anyway, I think that was the last of them. Let's get back to Isla. I hope you have a great birthday, Atlas. Alright, let's, uh... Ascent. Birthdays are such a crazy concept. A whole day just to celebrate one special person who gets adored with gifts, attention, and good memories? That's what I want for you. I want every day to feel like your birthday while you're with me. I'm going to make sure you love every bit of our game as much as you love me. Hello, adventurer. Thanks to you, I can finally see again. And my babies are safe. As promised, I can take you across the water to the town known as Punchimville. Are you ready to travel across the water, Atlas? Yes. Okay, don't forget to hold your breath. Loading. Halchumville. Halchumville? Okay, now I get it. Halchumville. We have arrived. Welcome to Palchumville. It sounds like the Snoodle Wonker was headed this way. We should head into town as soon as we can. Hey. Guggen? Oh, why, hello there, stranger. Welcome to Palchumville. Don't mind little old me, I'm just doing a bit of fishing. Are you missing a hand, by chance? I hope this new area is fun for you. If I had more time, I would have added more houses that you can actually go into. Hey. You know, I'm really pushing myself hard to make this all for you, right? It hurts a little bit, but it's worth it. Every friendship requires sacrifices. Right? Anyways, this is still a wonderful place full of wonderful people. You probably could have used some quests too, actually. But onward to adventure. There's people in here too. 
in old Palchumville. Palchum. Hello, everyone. Yes, it is I, Mayor Palchum. If you haven't already heard, things are not looking too good. What are we doing? Going to do? Why are you? We're dying out here. Please, one at a time. They will not divide us. We are strong. We'll solve this wrath problem. Well, so much for that. Oh my god, the mayor is dead. Was that a wrath? What do we do now? I'm freaking out. If only someone could boost our morale with words. Yeah, like an adventurer of some kind. That'd be convenient. That adventurer everyone is looking for sure sounds like someone I know. Look, it's an unlikely hero. Hooray! Please, hero, what advice can you give us during these awful times? Stop worrying. You'll be okay. Because I'm here. I never really thought of it that way. Wow, thanks. Okay, but we still don't have a mayor. What should we do? Get a new one. Oh my gosh. Yes, they're so right. What a clever hero. All right, I think you've gained our trust, hero. Please save us. We have a raft problem, and it's a bad one. You need to help us get rid of them. Yeah, kill them all. You need to go find Reginald the Wise right away. You can find him north of here at his pond. Yes, Reginald knows all. Please save us. Hey, Atlas, are you taking this seriously? The whole town I made for you is counting on us now. And that speech you gave didn't sound very authentic. Please just try harder for me. For us. If you can, okay? I put a lot of work into this game. Let's make sure we're having fun with it. Well, it looks like we need to find someone named Reginald the Wise. He's got to be around town somewhere. Well, let's explore, Atlas. What's this? Is this a person? Yep, it's Sherb. Beauty! My name's Sheriff Sherb, and I'm the law in this town. Most importantly, though, I'm a reliably, I'm a really good friend. No law is as powerful and important as the law of friendship. Now, get on the ground. You're under arrest for being too good of a friend. <laughs> this is fun. Being a sheriff is fun. All right. is dead. That thing killed the mayor. I am a widow. Oh god, I am a widow. What am I ever going to do? Attractive traveler, will you hold me passionately? No, I mustn't. Go, let me grieve. any bards lately? I myself am a bard. The greatest bard in all the lands, actually. I know how to perfectly entertain anyone, anywhere, anytime. I've mastered the craft, but I have no one to share my knowledge with. I want to take a new bard down the path of musical enlightenment. 
You seem like a creative mind full of wisdom and pure imagination. If only you were a bard, I could take you under my wing. If you find any talented bards around here, please inform me immediately. <gasps> well, things just keep getting better, don't they? And in. Let's set this in. Genie. Why, hello there, stranger. Welcome to my inn. You seem tired. Very tired. Feel free to use that bed over there to magically travel to another location or to other locations. And don't worry, you can travel back here too. I hope you enjoy your stay. Well, they seem nice. Would you like to sleep? Yeah. Where would you like to travel? The north. Good night, Atlas. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Ow. A bit. Just do this. So we arrive here in this guy's house. Grin. Please find Tortley. My love life depends on it. This home smells like love now. I think it's emitting off of Grin. Does that mean I gotta come back and use Grin's bed when, uh, I wanna travel back? I wanted to come here for one reason. That was just to go over here. Free him. I'm free! Ah, oh, I really liked my cage. But thanks anyway. Bye, friend. The hand tugs at my shoulder. Which one was dig again? Shovels K. You dig and find nothing. Invalid data available in my documents folder. I'm curious about these three documents that we found. Can I... Tab? No, I think if I just quit, it quits out completely. Yeah, the only way we'd be able to view those is to quit and then boot up the game again. Unless it is in settings, which I don't think it is. It's not. Okay. Um, well, it's been 48 minutes. This may be as good a time as any to stop. And, uh... Move on from what we're doing. Just uh, stop playing at this point. Actually, let me go back to the other place first, and then we'll stop there. Just in case I happen to forget. I was hoping it would also heal my character when I sleep. But it's not looking like it. Well, good morning, Sleepy. I hope you had a fun time in the dream realm. And don't worry, I watched you all night so you were safe. Alright. I see, like, our friend points are relatively low. They're not super low, so that's always good. Well, there you have it. We've gotten further into the story. We are now at Halchumville. And we're getting closer to the end. Maybe we'll end it before the month ends. If any of you didn't see the community post, Thursday, I'm going to be playing Buddy Simulator as well. So we're going to have Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Ghostwire Tokyo. Or no, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Ghostwire Tokyo. And then Tuesday and Thursday, Buddy Simulator. Saturday, just whatever I feel like on Saturday. And then Sunday, New Week, New Game. We only have one more horror-esque version 
of new week, new game to go. And then I think this Saturday coming up is going to be the last whatever day for October for Spooky Game Month. And then we move into November. This month's ending pretty quickly. I've enjoyed uh, playing these games though. These are games that I normally would not play because I'm not normally a spooky game kind of fan. But I've been enjoying the games that we have played. Like we've completed Hellblade, Senua's Quest, or Senua's Journey, Senua's Saga, I think it was. Senua's Sacrifice, that's what it was. Completed that. We 100%ed Amanda the Adventurer. I even had other games lined up just in case we finish these games sooner. But I figured with the only having one Thursday left in the week, starting a new game this Thursday wouldn't make much sense. Anyways, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next spooky game. Goodbye.